in the feedback that they got. Now, I have to confess, I would have predicted, based on my knowledge of dopamine circuitry and reward contingency, people will work much harder to prevent losing something than they will to gain something. And it turns out that that's not at all what happened. If they looked at the success rate of the subjects, what they found was that the subjects that were told that did not work, please try again, had a 68% success rate. 68% of them went on to successfully program this cursor moving through the maze. Whereas the ones that were told you lost five points had a 52% success rate, which is a significant difference. But the source of the success or the lack of success is really interesting. The subjects that were told that did not work, please try again, tried many, many more times per unit time. In other words, they made more attempts at programming this thing to allow this cursor to move through the maze. Whereas the people that were told you lost five points gave up earlier or gave up 